Investigators believe a Louisville ISD teacher sexually assaulted a 10-year-old student inside of a classroom. That's among several details included in a newly released affidavit for the arrest of John Colette. Police arrested the Kami Elementary School teacher last week, just days after officers began investigating. Fox Wars' Blake Hansen went through the new court records and joins us now with the latest. Blake. Yeah, Heather, those court records reveal how the case unfolded over the last few weeks and also raised some additional questions. 56-year-old John Collette remains in the Denton County Jail, charged in two separate incidents with the same victim at Kami Elementary earlier this month. According to court records released Wednesday, police in the colony began investigating April 13th after the 10-year-old girl told her parents what happened. The girl told her mother the assaults happened on April 12th and April 5th. The girl reported it happened during an after-school club and said that weekly she goes to Colette's classroom after school and that he gives her a kiss goodbye, then closes the door and leaves her in the classroom alone while he attended to other duties. The girl reported when Colette returned on the 5th, he touched her inappropriately. On the 12th, she told investigators she sat on his lap, got a piece of candy, and fell asleep while on his lap because she was tired. She told investigators when she woke up, he touched her inappropriately. The girl also told investigators there was never anyone else in the after-school club, and they never did the club's activity. Investigators later learned the club met a different day, and the victim's name was not listed for the club. Last week, some parents told Fox 4 Colette was a well-liked teacher. In fact, he was voted 2022 Elementary School Teacher of the Year in the Best of Denton County publication. The school is in Louisville ISD, which said in a statement he was immediately placed on administrative leave. Last week, the colony police said there were no other known victims, but they were encouraging people to come forward if they had any information. I did reach out to the colony PD today to find out if there were any other allegations, but did not hear back. We did not find an attorney listed for Colette.